morning. I hope you are absolutely amazing. I just wanted to make a quick video. Um, we're going to be talking about how do YouTubers keep their their houses clean. I have no idea. But before I go on to that video, I just wanted to say thank you, thank you, thank you to every single one of you that have liked, that have commented, that have subscribed to my channel. I'm now at 63 subscribers. I want to get to the 100. Start off there. We're all going to start somewhere. So um, a special thank you to many of the YouTubers that have subscribed um, to my channel as well. Barbara and Jan and Michelle and so many others. Um, I also want to make a special um, mention to Lucy Wilson who has been my number one fan. She has been my ca campaigner um, and commenting on all the videos that she can. So I really appreciate that. I absolutely love it. Um, I am sort of starting something new on um, with YouTubers. So if you are a small YouTuber, I want to sort of create this sort of community, um, interact with you um, and you know help us all grow. So do comment down below if you want to be part of that and we, we can set up a community and really start growing. Um, so anyway, um, I just wanted to make this quick video because I was looking at other YouTubers and their houses all seem to be clean. Now I know it looks really bad because I, I really need my boots done and nothing shows up more than this little ponytail actually. Um, but uh, yes, I was watching other YouTubers and their houses seem to be completely tidy. The ones with, you know, a couple of kids or whatever. And their houses are so tidy. So I have no idea how they do it. And, you know, I don't know, you probably can't see right now, but there's washing everywhere. So I'm just going to pull up the pile of washing. It's Saturday. This is the tidy day. Um, and I did, oh, I wanted to show you this. Look at my covers, the Dumbo covers. They're absolutely stunning. I love them so much. I got them from Primark. And they are reversible. So you can see that you've got your Dumbo on this side. Um, and then you've got your Dumbo, little Dumbos with your spots on the other side. So that's the way we've got it set up. And I just wanted to mention some random things that I have in my house okay so I've got <laughs> I've got this squeegee thing in my bedroom I'm, the random things in my bedroom not even in my house I've got loads of random things in my bed in my house but in my bedroom I've got this squeegee thing it's actually for the shower we've got a, an ensuite there but it's for the shower we've also got I'm going to show you this I've put them all up on uh, Damien's side of the bed but we've got sellotape from when I was wrapping presents um, around Christmas. You know, some of the time that I go up here, got my sister's presents, mum's presents, and um, a light bulb, okay? And um, the reason for this is I, I know that you have to recycle these, so I'm not got around to recycling it. Um, I kind of will just, that's absolutely fine to have in a, in a bedroom. I've got a spanner, okay? And I was trying to work out why I would have a spanner up here. Really? But it's because sometimes, well, a couple of weeks ago the bed was getting a bit loose. When we were going into it, I thought, mm, it feels a bit funny. And I was worried that I was going to have to have a new bed. But it turns out that it was just loose and I just needed to tighten up. And I still haven't put it down. Like, who else does that? I mean, I cannot be the only one that does that. Um, but what I would say is, um, these other YouTubers, now they do seem to be big YouTubers and I would say that when I get to like 100,000 subscribers, I will tell you, I personally pledge that I will tell you how to keep your house clean um, when you're a, a big YouTuber because it's something I want to know. I want to know how do you keep your house clean if you've, you know, is, is it because you're a YouTuber full time and you've got all the time in the world? I don't know, they're always clean. And, and I'm looking at my house thinking, oh my gosh, I'll show you my washing pile. I'll put these away first. And by the way, I hope you know that I mean exactly in the same place that they were before and not actually away. Okay, so here is my washing pile. This is 
a pile of clothes that have been washed, have been dried and are getting ready to be put away. This is a little bit of it. So halfway through that, I realised that I've got, um, I had my hairdryer and my straightener attached to the, the washing basket. So that was a lot harder job than I thought. So this is like two, wa two washings, two loads for five people. So I start off and I, I literally, I'm just putting them into different piles and seeing how it goes. So Orla and Mirren, um, their job was to uh, tidy up um, yesterday, tidy up the kitchen. So they tidied up the kitchen and they tidied up, um, they, they were to tidy up the rooms. Now Mirren is currently, um, Mirren is currently tidying up her room. Um, the problem is, is that the girls are the same size, so I never know which one is which. I really don't. I just alternate and they tell me, they say, no, oh, it's not mine. Um, so, yeah. Oh well. Um, yes, so Mirren is tidying up her room and Dylan has just come home from Sky last night. I'm so excited to see him. Um, so we'll be able to get a chat with him, see what you liked. Um, I was talking to him last night and it was just so cute because he's oh, he's just so enthusiastic about it and I just think it's, it's just really awesome when new children, you know, they're growing up and boy do they grow up fast and still get to talk to them, you still get to talk to them. So I think that's really cute and really sweet. So I'm going to continue on and just keep doing this. Um, and I'm going to put it on like Benny Hill style. amount of clothes um, and then there's a few bits for the girls but I definitely have the winning part there's one t-shirt for Damien and one two three three t-shirts for Dylan but don't worry do not worry I don't want you to fear that I'm running out of things to do because the washing basket is back up and full again so yeah let's go do that